Chapter 9. How many times? Abu, I have got really good with addition and subtraction. That's very good, Priya. So why don't we move ahead? It's time to learn multiplication. Let's look at a problem. There are four children. Each child has two legs. So how many legs are there in all? If you add up all the legs, you get 2 plus 2 plus 2 plus 2 equals 8. That would be four children, and each child has two legs each. If you multiply it, it is 4 times 2 equals 8. That is because there are four twos being added. So you can see that multiplying is adding something many times. Let me give you one more example. Let's say there are five candies in three boxes. How many candies do we have in all? If you add it up, it would be five plus five plus five equals 15. If you multiply it, it would be three times five because you're adding up five three times. So that's three times five equals 15. Now let's look at some multiplication problems and make them addition problems. We have five times five, so that would be five plus five plus five plus five plus five equals 25. Here's another one. Four times seven, that is seven plus seven plus seven plus seven equals 28. Another one is four times six, which is six plus six plus six plus six equals 24. And here's another one, almost the other way around, which is six times four, which is four plus four plus four plus four plus four plus four equals also 24. So six times four has the same answer as four times six, because when you multiply numbers, it doesn't really matter the order you write them in. That's why the answer to six times four is exactly the same as four times six, which is 24. Now let's try doing it the other way. Let's make some addition problems into multiplication problems. So here's eight plus eight plus eight plus eight. So here you're adding eight four times. So that's four times eight equals 32. Here's another one. Five plus five plus five. So that would be three times five equals 15. Here's another one. Three plus three plus three plus three plus three plus three, which would be six times three equals 18.